Cheers. Oh God. Mm. Here today we are at I Chihuahua, guys. This is an absolutely delicious spread of authentic Mexican food. Scott has never had really authentic Mexican food before, so we're changing that today, guys. Here we have some delicious pozole, a very authentic Mexican stew. Uh, we have tacos, we have fish tacos, we have chorizo, we got uh, carne asada, we have El Pastor, it's all delicious street tacos, we got chimichangas, we have tacos dorados, we got tostadas. Like every, it just, it's, this is my favorite stuff, guys. I love authentic Mexican food, this is so authentic. We also have a number of different uh, pico de gallos, uh, chili verde, we have a red salsa as well. Scott, yeah. what do you think, dude? Well, I know it smells good, it looks delicious, I just can't wait to taste it, so. It smells good, yeah. looks good, so let's get eating here. All right. Um, so I'm gonna start with the taco. Okay. I think this is a chorizo, I believe. Get some guac, got all the delicious fixings on it as well. I'm a very much a big salsa and sauce guy. This is another one of their hot sauces. I'll try a bit of it there. Want to try some? Sure. Take your way. Mmm. 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 Oh boy. Mmm. 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 Dude, those flavors. Chorizo's got a nice little spice there. Mm. And the salsa adds a little bit more kick to it as well. This is spices. Oh mm. my god. Mm. Mm. I can barely talk. Oh, wow. The onion. The warm spices they have going on there. Mm. Probably put a little bit of pico on it. Yeah. Damn. That is probably the best, honestly, chorizo little street talk I've ever had in my life. That is just beautiful. Too good. All right. Mm. It's only getting better. Mm. Cheers. <laughs> I'll choose on that one. Mm. 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 Oh my god. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's too good. I think this is uh, this be the El Pastor. Sorry, Chef, I'm not waiting for you. No. This is too good. Try some of the chili verde on it. Got some salsa as well, brother. Oh, hold on. The second one? Cheers. Mm. Oh, God. Mm. It's just too good. That's beautiful. Look at that meat. Oh my gosh. I don't think I'm, I don't think I'm going to be able to speak. I think this video is just going to consist of mostly me saying, oh my God. Oh my God. Thank you, Lord Jesus. <laughs> this is so good. So we are just in the uh, basically Vancouver area. South Surrey to be specific. South Surrey, right near the border. Right near the border. And Canada in general doesn't have a lot of Mexican cuisine. So, we have authentic Mexican food here. It's like such a treat. Mm -hmm. mm. Wow, that's nice. Very, very good. Mm -hmm. You know, I think it's gonna, I'm gonna I'm stick with the tacos, man. I'm loving you so much. That's what I was thinking too. Going over this, uh, what are we gonna go with next? This is the uh, carne asada, I believe. The beef. Where's the beef? There it is. Delicious. If you want beef, then bring the records. Put on this, I like this with the hot sauce. Dude, the avocado, the guac, the onions and stuff they put on this, just oh, yeah. fantastic. Look at that guac. It's a nice healthy serving too of guacamole. Look at that. Very healthy. Mm. 
to a bad place. Mm. So good. The hot sauce is really good too. I love all the flavors. It's so good, I think I'll have another. I have a great. Please let me know, Scott, one of these sauces and stuff I have in front of me as well. Try all the sauces. Try the, uh, the green. That's the sauce. Is the green one? You have a uh, salsa verde, so green salsa. Green salsa. Uh, red salsa, and uh, you have the dish of pico de gallo. So. I gotta get my spoon here. Not enough with the fork. I know. Now that is a full, full, full street dog right there. All the sauces. Oh yeah, very nice. So good. Mm. Oh, there's a cilantro on there, just keeping it very fresh. That's almost all the tacos. Yeah. And then we have a tacos dorados. Okay. Tacos dorados, which are like a deep fried taco. I believe he's got one chicken and I believe one beef. Got some uh, pico on top, got some guac as well, some sour cream, some queso fresco. I'll try to, I try to show you a little more, but it would just fall. But uh, cheers. cheers. Cheers on this one. Mm. Very nice. Great flavor, that fried pork tortilla. Nice front, and the guac, and the queso, the sour cream, adding a nice savory aspect. It's on chicken. Mm -hmm. Very good. Chicken is very nice and tender. Got a nice light flavor to it. Got a nice crispiness on the shell as well. You can hear the crunch coming over there from Joel. I like that a lot. I dig. All right, so what do we got? Actually, wait, we still got fish tacos. Okay. Fish tacos, bro. I'm down for the fish tacos. I forgot all about that. Got a uh, chipotle mayonnaise on here. Got a nice looking slaw. Looks like a good one. I like all these things. Everything so far has been fantastic. So I have absolutely no complaints. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Comments the chef. How's the fish? Didn't try it yet. I was going to, but I thought I'd wait. Cheers. Took this in. What a gentleman. What a gentleman. Really great flavor in that chipotle. Mm -hmm. Nice and smoky. The slaw is really nice crunch. That warm deep fried fish. It's a catch. Yeah, it is a catch. Mm. I like that sauce. Yeah. I really like this hot sauce that I've got in there too. But all the sauces are really good. Mm -hmm. Whatever I got. How about try the chimichanga next? Looks delicious. Let's do it. They're actually very well known here for their chimichangas, which is something I find so interesting because my exposure has been quite limited to chimichangas, but this looks delicious. Deep fried burrito, essentially, guys. Dressed in beautiful sauces. Oh, yeah. We got some, again, the pico, queso fresco, guac on there. Enjoy, Scotty boy. Cheers. Very rich, very warm. Has some of this nice guac. Salsa, pico, fresco. Full of flavor. Yeah. Soft, warm. This one is kind of like a comfort food. Mm -hmm. The other toppings are just very, very fresh. We can go with some sauce on it. Love that smokiness, a little bit of sour cream, keeping it nice and fresh, warm.
delicious. Woo! Okay, well we had a full table here a minute ago, but we're starting to run out of items, dude. Well, I think the change up. Let's go to the pizzole. You want to go to the pizzole? Yeah, okay. and then we'll do the tostadas. Oh, okay. Okay. Unless you want to do it otherwise? No, no. That's uh, some more comfort food. Let's give it a go. Make sure it's well. Assuming it's not too hot. So pizzole, guys. I got some. Uh, a little hot, a little hot, but in a good way. Ooh. Yeah. I don't know what all the spices are that are in this. Yeah, this is a unique. But I really like it. It's a nice peppery. Yeah, from my understanding, it gives some pork. Yeah, chickpeas, pork. Very nice, like peppery. Peppery, you know, peppery is a good word for it. Mm -hmm. Peppery is a good word. Very soft, braised. Meat in there. A little bit of like spice, not like a, I don't want to say chilies, but definitely peppery. Mm -hmm. Nice and rich too. That's some good comfort food. Yeah. Definitely a comfort food. Nice chunks of meat in there. I like this a lot. The meat's so tender, it's just melting in the mouth, so absolutely delicious. I like Bring this hot sauce. Great in. texture. Oh, yeah. Love the spice. Love the sauces. Mm -hmm. Great flavors. Oh, boy. That broth. Woo! You know it's good broth when Joel has the whole thing, right? Okay. Gotta do it. I like it a lot. Leave it no doubt today. Okay. Did he give some chips and stuff with the pozole? I kind of just ate all the pozole, so I'll leave those, but now we're getting on to the last of it. Tostadas. I love tostadas. I got one beef, got one chicken. We'll quickly go to Tostada. Tostada, guys, got a beautiful crispy bit underneath that is fried. Queso, sour cream, guac. I got a chicken one here. Chicken one there. Salsa. This is a good good size, too. I, I, this is one thing I cannot fit all in my mouth. We usually have a little taco in there, but not one of these. Feels like food. That's a great choice to leave to the end. Refried beans on there as well. <coughs> Sorry, I inhaled it. It's that good. Oh. Mm. That's fantastic. Yeah. So good. It's a nice flavor profile, the whole thing. Everything goes so well together. <coughs> Sorry, I still got it in my windpipe. <laughs> you gotta eat it, guys. Don't breathe it. <laughs> Love it. Got warmth, got crisp, got freshness, the pico, the guac. Got creaminess. Mm. Yes. Very yes. Awesome. And last but not least, have this last tostada here, guys. Ooh, this one is big and juicy. Very juicy one. Oh, yeah. That beef. So good. This is more of that hot sauce they're making here. Love the peppers, love the flavors. I'm gonna start judging the size of things <laughs> by my mouth. So the tacos are like less than one jaw mouth. A tostada is about one and one third jaw mouth. <laughs> that was delicious. Mm. Dude, how was your first exposure? It was awesome. To yeah, me. I mean, enjoyed all the sauces. I uh, enjoyed definitely the food. The sauce is just... Uh, I'm just going to drink the salt. Yeah. <laughs>
Man, the flavors. I love, love, love authentic Mexican. Yeah. Guys, everyone in the greater Vancouver area, definitely come up by Ch Chihuahua. It is, it is as aesthetic as you're gonna get. Food was good. I'd like to thank Jose here. He was excellent. If you guys ever come in here, say, call, tell him Jose, say, hey, we saw those two crazy guys on YouTube. Tell him I saw, the, I saw those guys that ate way too much. <laughs> seriously though, guys, seriously, I Chihuahua, yeah, great yeah. food. Would recommend this place. Absolutely loved it. We ate pretty much the whole menu, guys. Um, they also have taco salads. If you want taco salads, we got a few more items, guys, burritos and such, obviously. So everybody, until next time, thanks so much for watching. Huge thanks to I Chihuahua. And of course, Stay happy with how you're happy, getting happy all the day. This you can actually do today. This, one, yeah. this you can do, you can come get yourself some food. I would recommend filling the table. You don't need that much. Only I do, you don't need that much. But seriously guys, so good. Scott, get to pick a favorite, what was it? Uh, I, I, I guess the, uh, the soup, which was the- The pizzole? Pizzole, yeah, that was really good. It had the nice uh, peppery flavor to it, so. And had the nice tender meat in there as well, and it just made you feel nice and warm because it's uh, a little bit colder out nowadays. So. You know, if I had to go for it, honestly, guys, all the street tacos, the, the chorizo was exceptional, the uh, carne asada was exceptional. I also very, very much love those tostadas and the taco dorados. I love every, I love, I love everything, guys. Let's be honest. Let's be honest. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, guys, till next time. Like I said, just have a lovely life. Much love. I appreciate you guys so much for watching. Let us know down below if you like this video. Of course, comment, subscribe. Feel free to share. So next time, we're gonna bring you some more eats, some more food. I love you. everyone thank you so much for watching today's video i really appreciate it if you click my face right here you can subscribe yes that's right click my face subscribe guys it helps me out it helps you out then you don't miss an upload and hopefully i can meet you when i come to your city also click a video right here i specifically pick two videos yes that's right two videos specifically for you right here so click a video right now get that going and it's going to end so click one quick let's go let's go and have a great day